guys, I'm going to go over with you about the top 10 most interesting car logos. Number one, the Tesla logo. The Tesla logo is intended to represent the cross-section of an electric motor. Musk explained uh, to a querying uh, Twitter follower, the stylized X in the SpaceX logo is meant to represent a rocket trajectory. Now, let's look at the actual logo itself. Here it is, guys. The Tesla logo. Now, as you can see, it does look similar to that other than a fancy T. So, um, let's go on to our next one, shall we? Okay, guys, and here is the Hyundai logo. Discovering the origins of the Hyundai uh, logo, uh, while the H in uh, Hyundai's automobile logo uh, does stand for the company's name, it's also a stylized picture, a silhouette of two individuals shaking hands. One individual is a company representative, and the other is a satisf satisfied customer. So, let's go. In 1990, Toyota debuted the three overlapping ellipsis logo on American vehicles. The Toyota ellipsis symbolized the unification of the hearts of our customers and the heart of Toyota products. The background space represents Toyota's technological advancement and the boundless opportunities ahead. So as you see, this is the fancy T, that's the O, that's the Y, that's the O. That's the T, and the A is right around there. So, yes, let's go on to our next one, shall we? Okay, now, guys, as you can see, our next one is Porsche. So, um, you can see Stuttgart. And, um, so let's uh, go on the back. Right there's Porsche. It has something to do with the coat of... In fact, in fact, the origins of the Porsche logo trace back to the coat of arms of the state of uh, Württemberg, of uh, former w Weimar uh, Germany, which once called Stuttgart, where Porsche's uh, headquarters is located its capital, the horse on the logo, which was taken from Stuttgart's coat of arms. Let's go on to our next one. And right here is the Buick logo. The company's founder, David Dunbar Buick, hailed from Scotland. The emblem is simply his ancestral coat of arms. Let's go on to our next one. Alright guys, our next one is Cadillac. The Cadillac crest was inspired from the coat of arms of French adventurer Antoine de la Moth. Uh, Sierra de Cadillac, who founded the city of Detroit in 1701 and is said to have been an ancestor of Cadillac's founder, Henry Leland. The original coat of arms uh, was divided into two parts, a coat and a shield. Alright, our next one is Subaru. About the Subaru logo below, the word Subaru means united in Japanese, and Fuji Heavy Industries has uh, used the terms to describe how the uh, Pleiades uh, constellation is a unification of the stars. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six. They are a constellation, therefore. Let's go on to our next one. And this is our Acura logo. Acura, the Acura logo plays with our minds a little bit. Most observers think the logo is a stylized letter A for Acura, just like Honda's logo is a stylized H for Honda. But according to Honda, Acura's parent company, the image is a caliper, a design instrument used for measuring thickness. So, um, let's go on to our next one, shall we? Alright, and here is our Alfa Romeo logo. The meaning behind the Alfa Romeo logo, Alfa actually stands for Anonima Lombardo Fabrica Automobili, which translates to Lombard Automobile Factory Public Company. The company wanted to be associated with the city of Milan, so they used uh, the Red Cross around here that was typically a symbol of the Crusades in Milan and as you can see there's a snake that is a purifying a human or a human is being purified by a snake whichever way it goes um let's go on to our next and final one shall we 
And now we have Mitsubishi's logo. The name Mitsubishi consists of two parts. Mitsu meaning three in Hishi, which becomes Bishi under Rendaku meaning water, Caltrop also called water chestnut, and hence rhombus which is reflected in the company's logo. It is also translated as three diamonds, which is what you see here with the Mitsubishi logo. And that is our top ten interesting car logos of the day. Well, any other day, as a matter of fact.